Hi, my name is Josiah. I'm with Waves. I'm the US Live product specialist. I'm here at Road Crew Live, hanging out with Tone Tailors, and figured I'd take the time to just show you guys uh, our SuperRack software. Um, some of you, a lot of people out there might already know about MultiRack, which has been our live plugin DSP processing software for years um, that is basically used in conjunction with uh, other consoles. Um, so, uh, in that, uh, Super Rack now is the next uh, version of, of that. Uh, so basically now Super Rack will support all, all future plugin formats going forward. And, uh, but the biggest difference in the technology that we're doing now these days with Super Rack is um, now Super Rack allows sharing. So if you have a few systems, like in this instance, I have a Super Rack system here and I'm sharing um, I.O. between uh, the LV1 system and SuperX. LV1 is our live mixing console. Um, so you could share between the LV1 mixing console, you could share between another SuperX system. So if you have uh, maybe a, two Digicos and you guys want to share um, playback, um, just run playback through the driver. Uh, you could send it to both systems by sharing the driver. So you can share drivers, share I.O. So it creates a lot of flexibility in the system. Um, and then beyond that, uh, SuperRack also now uh, has uh, custom layers. You know, so bes besides this new touchscreen workflow, we've got uh, multiple layers here. And with those layers, you have custom layers, which allow you to put things where you need them. So uh, you could put uh, a vocal you know, next to your vocal group or vocal effects, and you can move them wherever you need. Um, and you have four pages of those with 16 um, racks on each. Uh, so it gives you lots of, lots of flexibility in just customizing your workflow now um, with uh, some new features as well with each plugin, you used to be able to sidechain just off the single rack. Now you can sidechain individual plugins. So if we have a certain input off the MGB, we could sidechain this plugin to MGB channel seven, and we could do sidechain this plugin from another input on the MGB, maybe 17. Um, so, which gives us an even more precise um, workflow here to, to go after the things that we actually need to accomplish here. Um, when, when, if you're side chaining, um, maybe you're looking to receive source from different places, there's so many options there. Um, so you can see the workflow from SuperRack is kind of adapted from some of our live console um, in the way it looks. Um, and the nice thing in all of this workflow, um, you still have new views that you can expand to. It'll support up to four screens. Um, so you can drag any of these windows out and, and move them to wherever you, you need them. If you have another screen attached, um, you can drag a plugin out. If you want to see it on another screen, it's something you need to see up front and right away. Um, same with any user keys or hot plugins. Uh, you can drag those out and see them on screens and save those in snapshots. So it makes it easier to get around, makes it your, your customized workflow a lot easier, as well as um, the addition of other effects too. So if you have a hardware piece of gear that you want to integrate into SuperRack, um, you can add it to within your chain of plugins here. So I have uh, maybe a, a couple waves plugins here for my vocal chain and I can add an external insert. If I've got a hardware piece of gear, I can take an analog source here um, and patch the send and return from the analog input. Um, or, you know, if we have digital via MADI over our MGB here, we can come in MADI or we can even use uh, a driver. So if we have another um, effect on a computer that we want to patch in, we could use the digital driver, sound grid driver, and send to and from. So, and now that's a part of, you know, our chain um, for our channel. And in that, you know, you're granted you are whatever latency is induced by that uh, hardware piece of gear or plug-in or other computer, um, you know, that'll affect your channel, but we do give you a an option if you can measure the latency to adjust the latency here. So there's so many options in uh, SuperRack just for uh, additional workflow options to kind of create the workflow that works for you. So thank you again for watching. Um, 
This is Josiah with Waves Live. Take care. Thank <laughs> you.